I mean, Waddell's been throwing like that all year, and um, you know when he comes out and throws strikes, um, you know it's it's been it, it's been the same outcome all year for that kid. And um, you know we can't ask anything better for a winner go home situation for him to come out and fill the zone. We can't really ask for much of that. How much of a pick me up is that for all you guys? I mean, it's huge. You know, he kept us all in the game. He's putting the ball in the play, putting the um, you know ball on the ground, and you know giving us some opportunities in the field, and uh, you know just keeping us in the game the whole time. But you know credit to him, he's throwing strikes. He's also throwing and some swing and miss pitches and when he's doing that it's pretty hard to score. It was, it was awesome and, and right after it was finished I got the last out he was like give me that ball and I was extremely proud to give it to him and he did, he did a great job for us tonight and we're looking forward to it tomorrow. For Brandon to go all nine, you know, that's huge. Having already come out, who's basically been unhittable, and Howard out of the pen, who's just, you know, towered. Nobody touches him. So, you know, uh, we have a lot of confidence and just a great game by Waddell to save our bullpen. You, know, you guys have been doing all year working for this moment. What's it like now that it's kind of right in front of you? You know, it's a little surreal, but our coaches do a great job at just telling us just to, just to play the game. It's just another baseball game. I know it kind of sounds a little bit cliche, but it, you got you to go pitch by pitch and just play the game. You can't ask for anything more. You know, it's something that, uh, you know, you, you dream about as a kid, and, um, you know, it's going to be a lot of fun for sure. Uh, yeah, we were just talking about it. It's kind of surreal that, uh, you know, all the work we put in finally comes down to one game. but. Um, Coach Oak mentioned after the game again, just just have fun, loose and aggressive. Nothing changes. Um, you know, we've earned the right to be here, so you know, just go out and do what we do every day. What's been in that incident in the eighth? How do you feel about what went down? But right. I mean, there uh, simply there was no malicious intent to it. It was it was just a hard baseball play, and it was a dead on arrival play. So when the ball went back to the pitcher, I was I was in a rundown. And my job was to get the the runner, the batter runner to second base, and I was just going hard, and, and he was in the baseline when I was going back to the bag. Any of those guys say anything to you? Mm -hmm. How much of a role do you think your mustache played in the <laughs> I think it uh, played a huge part. No, I think I mean it just kind of shows, you know, a lot of us. Some guys went and dyed their hair. I mean, Taylor Myers got this black caterpillar on his lip. I mean, it's unbelievable, but it, it shows that. Uh, you know, we're not tense, and uh, that's something that we've definitely brought to the clubhouse probably this last month and a half is just to have fun playing baseball. This is going to be the last year that we're this, this exact team is going to all be together, and uh, for us to come out in a winner, you know, winner go home situation, have fun, play baseball, a smile on our face is something that uh, you know not many people can say they can do at this point in the year.